A British royal discussion programme has heard that King Charles I's most recent public relations initiative showcased a picture of the royal family that is far different from the one that his youngest son, Prince Harry, painted in his historic memoir, Spare. The documentary Charles I.I. The Coronation Year, which aired in Britain over Christmas, featured an endearing image of the king that royal editor Emily Nash told viewers of a recently released episode of The Royal Beat will be interesting to anyone who reads Spare because it painted a rather different image of the way the royal family interact. Harry's memoir, which was published in January 2023, became the fastest selling non-fiction book in history and gave an unmatched portrayal of life behind the palace walls by alluding to several royal dramas that had occurred over the previous 40 years. One of Harry's primary complaints in his book was the absence of physical closeness or affection among the royal family, something he has since stated he is careful not to repeat with his own children. The prince disclosed to the public that he never got an embrace from his grandmother, Queen Elizabeth I, and that he was merely given a pat on the knee when his father, Charles, informed him of his mother's passing in 1997, when he was just 12 years old. Meghan, the prince's wife, also made reference to the revelation in their 2022 Netflix documentaries. The Duchess revealed to the audience on the show that she was taken aback when she first met future sister-in-law Kate and discovered that she was resistant to hugs. It's like I was a hugger. I've always been a hugger, she stated. I didn't realize that that is really jarring for a lot of Brits. BBC cameras followed Charles for his first full year on the throne, including the period leading up to his coronation on May 6, 2023, as part of a recent documentary. The video shows the monarch embracing and kissing members of his family, including Kate, Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and his brother, the Duke of Edinburgh, and playing fully teasing with his eldest son, Prince William. Charles is really very tactile, Nash said to the royal beat. We witnessed it even the day after the Queen's passing, when he came to London. It was wonderful to see that glimpse into that familial contact, as you say, because we never saw the late Queen hugging people in the public. He was out there doing that. She said, and there was that great time when he and William were making jokes about his fingers. Which shows again a sense of humour that perhaps people hadn't appreciated beforehand. Charles made mention of his large fingers in one tape, which have drawn a lot of attention from the media and social media users over the years. During a practice coronation, William struggled to close a clasp on the monarch's robes. Charles laughed, saying, you haven't got sausage fingers like mine.